Hello. Hello. สวัสดีค่ะ Hello. How are you today? I'm fine. Question. No question. Good. I thankfully just woke up. Okay. Let's hear about Sipti's exciting <coughs> day. Today I worked on my painting until seven thirty. Okay. Is it all done? It's beautiful. <laughs> Looks like the Mona Lisa. Mona Lisa? No. No. Oh no. Okay. Far from. I far from from him. <laughs> okay. From him. Ah, uh, from it. From it. Okay. What does it look like? Look, looks. Is there a cat? Look. Angry cat. Before, before I try to, I try to to put put pin. Pin my friend. Your friend. Yes. Your friend. What's the your friend doing in our painting? I d- to paint um, my picture on my fellow. As a you mean as a as push, a guide. Push my friend. Do a friend in the picture. Okay. But what is she doing in the picture? Who's she? She's the lieutenant. No, um, Simon. Simmons. Q. Oh, okay. Yes. <laughs> but okay. And you before I I. I don't want to to um, painting every everyone just just let it come from my head. Okay. Before. But now it just it's it looks horrible. Change every hour. <laughs> what what comes from your head is it you you paint with your eyes closed and then you open you're like oh look at look at all this wine. Yeah. <laughs> What's I, on there? I mean, what do um, you what do you see? You paint and then it comes from your mind and then what is it? Look horrible. It's like a party with. Not with, not party. Oh no. Okay. Because because I searched information about the wrong lane. The. The wrong lane. Not wrong. Long right. lane. Right. Oh, okay. On Google, and see what happened. What and look. Looked. Looked. And you, well, you're searching for Pijan. the long rain, and Pijan. then you're like, ah, oh, parties. <laughs> no, 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 I gotta work. Right. Because I want, wanted some white wine. To know, okay. no, ginger. we gotta get, a, we gotta get some wine for for uh, this. After, after, after this, after so we need a bo- we need like a bottle of finished. white wine. Put it around here. Somewhere. And you want to, you want to see, you want to see. The how painting? how many how many bottle bottles? No, I'm just I'm saying for the show we need we need a cat, we need some more decorations. But the show's out of money, so Sifty will have to pay <laughs> <laughs> I can, for her birthday. I can. Are you rich from your birthday? Birthday money coming this week? How much money will your dad give you? Ten thousand. Birthday. Birthday money. For me, this this year, mm-hmm. I. What are you going to do for your birthday? I want to. Cosa m o i I I want to go to the sea. The sea. With with my mom. Okay. You and your mom at the sea. Mm. And duck. No. Oh no. Okay. No. No. <laughs> Just you and your mom. What will you say to your mom when you go to the sea? Say, hey, mom. Don't don't um we have p i e c e of a. A what? Cut Paste off. Over. Don't cut off. Don't cut off. Me. What does that mean? Don't, don't stop me. giving me money. Don't cut me off from yeah. the. Yeah. <laughs> 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 okay. No. What will your mom talk about? What will you and your mom talk about? You're walking on the beach. I'll be your mom. Okay. Mm. So Zipti, what do you want to talk about? Talk about. Um, if you have problems. I have a lot of problems. Yes. Yeah. Don't quiet. Don't be quiet. Don't okay. be quiet. You can. Right now, I'm go up a little bit. Then before, you can talk with me. Grow up? I don't think grow up, but I'm older. I'm older than before. Than before. Or I'm more mature. More mature. More mature. 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 Means. Mm. Professional. Strong. It means. Cool. It means older, but not just age. It means 
more stronger and smarter. Thing, no? Thinking. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, look at me. That's uh, <laughs> not me. Oh, well, what does your mom like to talk about on your birthday? Um, is she gonna give you like something special? Say, hey, Sibti, this is the sword from your great grandfather. No, no bring she, it on the show. She give, she give pie for me every time. Pie, a um, pie. Pies. Pies. No, no, she give, she gave things for me. To me. To me. Like what? Every every time. Rice. Many time, often. What would be a good present for Thai people? Rice. Rice, rice, <laughs> <laughs> what, rice what and make get? beer, yes. Yeah, rice before. beer, right, that's uh, from yeah. Japan, sake. 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 What do you want for your birthday? What should um, we get you for your birthday? Just. Some YY. Just. Um, Wi-Fi password. No, no. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I should, I should try to do. How about a sword? Should we get you a sword? What? I, I, I don't know. Oh, okay. What well, I what want. do you want? What do you want for your birthday? Just. Stay with my mom. Right, but I'm saying, dad. what would be a good present for you? My parents, eh? because we didn't live together. We don't stay together. We don't stay together. Right, but haven't you gotten a good present? What did duck? What did all these guys get you? Seal, duck, rat, cockroach. What did they buy you? What Ta was a good present from them? Tiger, tiger, just back. Bag. A bag. A bag. You but don't like bags. Yes. Look <laughs> That's very horrible. Get rid of him. Okay. Next one. Sweet color or something. Sweet. And pink. What's sweet? Yes. Pink. Not pink, but look. Look. You should, if it's complicated, you should just say yeah, John. Pink. <laughs> make it easy. <laughs> I don't, I don't say know no. why I like to make trouble for myself. Oh my god! Yeah, just say exactly, John. Exactly. Yes, John. Yeah, that's pink. Right. Exactly. Okay, um, and then. And duck. He. Like, Next one. Like to surprise. Surprise. And this. <laughs> yes. Give you like a sword he or something. Took my friends. Came. In the restaurant. Oh, you mean a surprise party? Surprise. He threw you a surprise party. Yes, and oh, okay. give thing things for me. To me. To me. Like what? Shoes. 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 Okay. Shoes. Well, like his old shoes. Like, hey, I don't need no, these good, anymore. Good luck. We <laughs> lifestyle. Um, <laughs> same. Same lifestyle. We have the same lifestyle. We have the same lifestyle. Like what? Not sleeping. No. <laughs> oh, okay. Um, song, music, music, the clash, Thing, things. Oh, okay. Last time when we this, this. You wear the same clothes. No. Uh oh, he has a dress and you have no, a dress. Look similar. <laughs> okay. <but laughs> okay. Okay. Anyway. Okay. And what was, what's a great present that you got? What's the best present that I, you ever got? Most people give me all my life, but I sometimes. Most people give you what? Many things. Like what? When what do you I, like? When I was young, um, toys, hmm? money, cash, that's always good. Computer, telephone. How about a gift certificate to beer chan? Yes, my husband <laughs> gave it. Okay, a case of beer. <laughs> and sh shirts. Shirts. Okay, how about a beer chan shirt? Oh, <laughs> no, no, other okay. people you profiling me. Profile, exactly. But That'd it's be real. Bad. It's That'd real. be bad. It's true. What's a good present though? What should we get Thai people for a good present? I meet somebody and say, simply, I need to get this Thai person a great birthday present. What you should sh I do? You should, you should know about them before. Right, and but I don't know anything about them. And see what they like. I can't see anything. I just need something good that Thai people like. What's a good present Simple for Thai people? Simple things. Simple things? Like what? Water? <laughs> Clothes. <laughs> a pen. 7-Eleven. 7-Eleven gift card. How about 7-Eleven <laughs> gift card? No. <laughs> no, no. Bag. Shoes. Bag. Bag. You don't like bags. Shoes. Oh, you are me. I yeah. don't like. What do you like? I mean, I think you mean other people. Yeah, but you or other people. Thai people. You're Thai, right? 
for me. Surprise at the end of the show, some people are like, "I'm Chinese." Ah. <laughs> <laughs> Guess what? <laughs> uh, sorry, no. tricked you. <laughs> I look like a Chinese. No. For me, right now, right now, I almost dirty. I I don't want anything. Just maybe like a cane, you know, like a walker. You know those old people. They <laughs> <laughs> no, okay. I have to exercise before uh, okay. I look like that. Right. Right now, I need I need just just cash, money, um, time to take care of my parent or my family. But that's not a present, though. What would be a good present for you? What do you want? They, I want them. A picture. How about a big picture of you? For your wall. <laughs> no, I, I, no, when no, I no. look, look at myself, it looks too. Well. <laughs> who's that? Uh, no, no, no. Who's that? No. Anyway, Sifty doesn't have any good presents uh, ideas, but we'll have to give some. We'll have to find something good for Sifty uh, on the show. Something. <laughs> remember, we had the Nutella. That was good. What? <laughs> remember the Valentine's? Nutella. We had the Nutella. Yes. <laughs> that was good. Have. That was good. Okay, so uh, I'm going to uh, continue now with a little bit of American history here. Um, do you know what? Of course, you know what it is. Speaker. <laughs> <laughs> right, free ladies. Yes, I, I Chinese. forgot real name. Statue of Liberty. Oh, stat, 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 statue. 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 This is called a statue. All of these things. It doesn't have to be. Doesn't have to be like this, but a person that's made of stone or metal is called a statue. Statue. It could be a dog, also. It doesn't have to be a person, but statue of liberty. Liberty means freedom. Liberty. Liberty. Right. Statue. Or Chinese people say the free lady. They're looking for they're looking for the free ladies uh, in New York, but they don't know that it's a statue of liberty. So I don't know very much about American history. Uh, so this is not going to be an American history class because <laughs> I don't really know <laughs> very much about American history. But uh, I remember when I was younger, I tried to watch a movie about the Civil War. It was a mm. Ken Burns. It was like 16 hours, and I watched it. And then at the end, I thought that was a waste of <laughs> 16 hours. <laughs> so I didn't watch any more after that. But anyway, I just want to teach you a few things, like about the Titanic. So that you understand, uh, when people talk about things, you just have a little bit of an idea. But these, but I don't really know things perfectly. I didn't research <laughs> any of these things, so you shouldn't uh, take my my history class uh, as too serious. It's just for um, basic no, stereotypes no. and racist things and simple things so that you can understand um, what basic people know. Okay? What they talk. Right. Just just the simple things so that you know basic basically what happened. So a long time ago, right, there was a guy named Christopher Columbus. And he was I think he was Italian, but he was working for Spain. Spain. Yeah. And he wanted to go to China. Okay, so you know America. Uh, not this one. That's that's going to be the next one. So uh, America. Uh, you know the, the the map of America. I forgot. Look. Anyway, so uh, California. From mm. California, you can go to Japan and China. Mm. But from from Spain. You can't go to China. You you come to New York first. Yeah. So a long time ago, people didn't know what there was in the ocean, mm. in the Atlantic Ocean. They didn't know. They thought it's um, still. Uh, well, that was a, still some people think the Earth is flat. Those mm. are flat Earthers, but th that's different. So there were people who who wanted to go to China mm. to buy things in China. Silk and different spices, and they they wanted to go to, to to trade in China, but they had to go all the way down under Africa, 
all the way up to get to China. It took a really long time and it was really dangerous. So some people, they weren't sure, but、mm-hmm. they thought that maybe if they went this way,、mm-hmm. they could go to China. They weren't sure though. They, they didn't know. know. They didn't know what was on the other side of the ocean. They just, they thought, some people thought that if they went the other way, that they could go to China. So there was a guy named Christopher Columbus, and he got money from, I think it was Spain, and he tried to go to China.、Mm-hmm. So、he, By boat? Yeah, in the boat, in a sailing in, ship. In yeah, in a sailing ship. So he, he, tr- he, w- he tried to go to China. But instead, he came to America,、mm. uh, to an island somewhere.、Uh, I, I don't remember where it was. It wasn't, in, it wasn't in the United States. It wasn't in New York or anything. It was, it was lower down in the islands, I think in the Caribbean or something like that. So, anyway, he went there、mm-hmm. and he, he thought、uh, that the people might be Chinese.、Hmm. And so, The, in the stories that, we, that we're told, maybe it's true, maybe it's not, I don't know, but the story is that he thought that these people were Indos or、oh. in India, and so he called them Indos, or which, which became Indians.、Oh. Right? So not Indians like from India, Indians which we call Native Americans, people who lived in America before. Uh, European people came back.、Um, Baskin. Not black, but kind of brown. Yeah, China. Brown. Look like, looks like Look Asian, Asian people. Because they came from Alaska. People believe that thousands of years ago, that, that Alaska was,、uh, was a bridge and you could walk across Russia, across, across Alaska, and、mm-hmm. come down to America. So, people think that Chinese people or Asian people came to America long, 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 long time ago from, from some Alaskan area. Is it or not? No. Yeah, probably. But nobody knows because it's so long ago. <laughs> maybe, there were, maybe there were aliens or something. Who knows? I don't know.、Yeah. But anyway, so Christopher Columbus supposedly came to America first. But there are other stories that. That other people went to America much earlier than that. Vikings or people from a long time ago going to Canada. But anyway, so Christopher Columbus went to America first,、mm-hmm. that everyone knows about. Before that, there were no writings. So maybe people went to America before him, but it's not well, it's not written down.、Mm-hmm. So that's why. He's、uh, famous. First, first. Yeah. So he went to America and then he went back to Spain and he said, okay, there's a lot of, there's a lot of people there, there's a lot of land there.、Uh, and so then everyone decided, well, we got to go and get the, get the gold. There was a lot of gold and、uh, money there、when、and he, land. When he found America for a time, What popular, the, what popular he wanted to, to buy, to、um, make business? No, they, they just wanted to take the land. So, yeah, so Indian people, the, the Native Americans,、mm-hmm. right? We say Indian, they used to say Indians.、So、it's rude now to say Indian. So you can't say Indians. We say Native Americans. But when. When people came to America,、mm-hmm. they thought, well, we got to get rid of these people and steal <laughs> this, this land.、Oh. So that's why、uh, you see in, in many stories, people、yeah. will say, well, in, in Thailand also. Yeah. So they went there, and at first they said, okay, can we buy this land? And they didn't speak, any, they didn't speak English. Eventually, they started to fight. And、uh, European people killed most of the Indians that、mm-hmm. were there. I think probably 55 million people,、oh, well, probably,、yeah. with diseases and warfare and、uh, all kinds of different tactics. Tactics? So, 
anyway, different, different, different weapons and different strategies. After that, uh, they started to make settlements. So people came from from the UK. Mm -hmm. That's why we speak English. And people came from Spain and uh, maybe some other countries. I'm not sure. But mo France also. People came to America and they made a city. Mm -hmm. There were there were still Indians there or Native Americans that would attack them. Mm -hmm. So and there were bears and it was dangerous. So they built walls around their city and they made a settlement and they lived there and they would bring more people from 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 Spain and from the UK and from France and oh, other countries from from Europe. Europe. Yeah, European countries. And they would make little little cities and little villages that they called settlements and then they started to grow and those became the cities and they learn language language each other what do you mean means um, before american don't know Jeep, spain language Sp Span spanish spanish or uh, language from from other country but when they came to live together no so each country tried to take as much land as they could the, they called it the new world mm. they came to america and they made cities and settlements and they said okay this is ours mm. we, we're taking this land and the french and the spanish and the and british people they made cities there as quickly as they could mm. uh, to take as much land as they could and defend it uh, from from each other fighting between each other so that happened for a long time until this until the uh, cities got very big mm -hmm. and then after that uh, American people not American people but British people they they had to send money back to Britain mm -hmm. taxes mm -hmm. the UK Britain they said, okay, you have to, you have to pay us money, mm. send us money in taxes. And of course, you know, people don't want to pay. So Americans, they were British people, but they said, okay, we're, we're Americans now. We don't want to pay any taxes. <laughs> so we're going to, we're going to leave Britain. Oh. We're not going to be friends with you anymore. So then there was a war, mm. okay, the war of independence in 17, let me see what I wrote here. 1775. 17. I wrote a couple notes because I, I, uh, there was a couple of things that I was wrong <laughs> about. <laughs> so uh, I didn't want to, I didn't want to get a few dates wrong. So in 1775, uh, um, the British people mm -hmm. decided, okay, we're not going to be British people anymore. We're going to be Americans. We're going to kick out British people. And there was a, there was a war. So the American people, well, they were British people. They mm -hmm. spoke the same language, but anyway, they, they won. And then America became uh, the United States. It took a while after that. Mm. Anyway, um, there were many, many wars <laughs> after that. Before it's easy to change, change you, what you want to be or what you want to live because no information about person. Oh, you mean immigration? Um, that happened a little bit, a little bit later. But yes, at that time, there were you didn't. There was no passport. If you wanted to go to America, it was dangerous. There were Native Americans there. There were bears. There were Spanish people that that would attack you, or American pe or British people. So mm. there were a lot of wars, and if people wanted to go to America, it was dangerous. But if you wanted to go, you could go. There was no, there wasn't a passport. There was no, there was no stamp. You just you just went. So I didn't know this, but anyway, the the point of this story is about the Statue of Liberty. And the Statue of Liberty was given to the United States from France in 18... I didn't know this. I thought, the, I thought that's why luckily I looked it up, <laughs> but uh, it was built in 1886. I thought, I thought 
and I think a lot of other American people think this as well because I didn't know. Mm -hmm. I thought the Statue of Liberty was given to the United States after World War I or maybe World War II. So I, I, I don't think I'm the only one because well, I've never yeah. heard that it was earlier than that. So I think a lot of Americans don't know uh, that. But anyway, it was given to the United States from France uh, mm -hmm. after um, the War of Independence and also Civil War, I think. Anyway, so uh, after that, um, mm, on the Statue of Liberty, there is a, there is a poem. Poem. There's a... Sintin. Mm, it's a poem. It's like a song, but it... Uh, but there's no music. Um, right? yeah. And it says, Give me your tired, your poor, your huddled masses, yearning to breathe free, the wretched refuse of your teeming shore. Send those the homeless tempest toss to me. I lift my lamp beside the golden door. So most people, I've never heard this last part, but I have heard many, many times, give me your tired, your poor, your huddled masses. So that means on the Statue of Liberty, it says, Okay, poor people can come to America. Mm. That's what it says. Feel. Now, <laughs> now America says, okay, no more. <laughs> no, no more people, no more people coming to America. Uh, Trump says, okay, you know. you're poor. <laughs> okay, mm. stay away from America. But originally, because there wasn't there wasn't a lot of people and it was dangerous there, uh, America needed people to come to make a country. And so it was. It was an opportunity for people to leave. But right now, everything is good, you know. Right. Too many people already. Too many poor people already, like me, and they don't need any more. But if you to... remember, in the Titanic mm. movie, Jack and his other friends are trying to go to America. Oh, uh, I I've kind of forgot, but I know he wanted to go somewhere. He wanted to go to America. So the Titanic had a lot of people who were going to America. But die. But die? But die. But died. Right, exactly. So even, uh, people were tr going to America for, for a very, very long time. The Titanic was in 1921, I think. It was much, much after uh, the Statue of Liberty and Civil, Civil War. People were going to America for a very, very long time. My, gran my great-grandfather came to the United States from Italy. Um, on a boat, probably. How, how they can find find land to live or house or they have to pay for someone? Else. No, because they just took it. The land was free. Oh, they killed, that, that's why other people try to come. Yeah, and because they want because they had nothing in their country. Oh. So they went to America because they thought, oh, I can finally get land. I can mm -hmm. have and can. I don't have to. I don't have to pay someone anymore. I can get my own land, and I can, but, I can grow right my own now things. It, it's hard to own. A well, now you can't. If you go to America, there's no free land, and there's yeah. no free ladies, free, <laughs> and there's no free <laughs> ladies, it. and there's no free land uh, in America anymore. Things are very expensive. <laughs> but at that time, uh, there was a lot of opportunity. Also. Uh, so, uh, let's get the date. So, remember, in 1492, Columbus went to America, mm -hmm. right? That's, what, 500 years ago? Before war. No, no, I'm just saying, 500 years ago, oh, about, yeah. about 500 years ago, right mm -hmm. Columbus, the first guy, his name was Christopher Columbus, went to America, America right? After that, about 300 years, almost 400 years, no, 300, 300 years, Probably that's 20. when the United States started in 17, like 17, almost 1800. So 200 years ago, the United States is about 240 years old now. Then the United States started, mm. the different, different Country. cities, they were cities, they were colonies, they grouped together mm -hmm. and they said, okay, let's make a country. So it became the United States. United right? States. United States. 
Now, the other thing is, is that people wanted to go to America mm -hmm. who, who were religious. Religious. They were called Puritans. They left England, no. they left Britain oh. because they didn't like the church. Church. The church. Do you know what a church is? The, the temple for Christian people. It's oh. called a church. Oh. Right? So the... Board. Is that what it's called in Thai? Board. Right? Well, that's a cross. But not a cross, but the, the place where Christian people Board. go. Like a um, temple, right? Yeah, it's like a, a temple. You go in there and you, you pray. You call stick. What do you call? Church. Church. You go in there and you pray. Mm -hmm. Right? On Sunday. So, uh, a lot of people who were religious, mm -hmm. they didn't like the Church of England. They didn't like the Church of Britain. England, Britain, UK. England, it's the same UK. thing, right? Different names. That's why it's English, though. Is England? Right. Usually, the name of the country is the name of the language, right? Mm. Thailand, Thai, right? Chinese, China, America, English. Different because came from uh, England, right? Okay. So, people, a lot of people, they didn't like the church in England. Because in that time, you had to go to church and you had to follow the Church of England. There was one church and they said, if you don't come to church, they'll fine you. You have to pay money. And if you don't come for a long time, you could go to jail. Oh my. Yeah. It's and not good law. Right. At that time, things were much different. People think that uh, that the UK and that America are free countries, Freedom. but they they weren't at that <laughs> at that at that time. Mm -hmm. So, at, in in that time in 1558, you had to pay 12 pence. It was about 15 dollars, 500 baht. Penny mm, No, it was it's just what they called their money at that time. You had to pay 500 baht if you didn't go to church. Mm. If the police caught you on Sunday not going to church, you had to pay 500 baht. And if you, did, if you got caught many times, you, you, you could go to jail, right? So, so many people, not just because of the money, but because everyone had to go to, the, to that church, they said, okay, we don't want to be part of this anymore. We're going to go to America. So many religious people came to America to run away from church. the church. They don't like something control you. Yeah. So that's why there are, there is a lot of religious people in the United States and a lot of Christian people because they, some of them, a lot of them were trying to escape from uh, Britain mm -hmm. and from the Church of England. Um, uh, after that, uh, there were many more wars. <laughs> mm -hmm. Eventually, uh, eventually, the United States uh, ended up fighting with North and South. We had another war called the Civil War. The North of the United States fought with the South of the United States and the south of the United States lost over slavery. American people are not, were not strong like Thai not people. Strong. Not strong like Thai really? people. You're in Thailand, body. well in Thailand, you know, you go to the farms, you see Thai, Thai girls working on the farm, right? Yes. Tough. American people were lazy and so, and British people. And so they brought people from Africa as slaves to work on the farms oh. and they didn't give them any money right they said they they said you have to work or we're going to kill you mm. so the united states had slaves that's why there's black people that's why there's african american people in the united states because they were taken from africa to mm. work in the farms what what do you give them nothing 
And if they didn't work, then they got killed. They got no money mm-hmm. and had to work for free. That's a slave, mm-hmm. right? Tan. So people, people at that time um, were, were not happy and still now. That's why we have problems in the United States now. That's why you see Ev- on TV. Everywhere, everywhere have problems. Right. Uh, well, but this is a very, this is a problem that's in the United States. Thai people did not, Thai people did not bring people from Laos to work for free. Mm-hmm. It's a different, different situation. Anyway, so after that, the mm-hmm. United States, uh, the north of the United States didn't want to have slavery anymore. And the south of the United States said we, we want to have slavery because they had a lot of farms down there. Mm. So then there was a there was a war called the Civil War in 18, 1860. Yes, the United States fought against the United States. And there's a really funny part because the president mm. of the South of the United States, his name was Jefferson Davis. They don't really say this in the American... I didn't learn it in school, but I've learned it in in Book. other research after that mm. he, he when the when the north of the united states came to capture him mm-hmm. he tried to dress up like a girl yeah. he put a dress he put on a dress <laughs> to try to escape <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> but they caught him and he was wearing a dress he he was um president but he no you fighting? Uh, well, no, of course not. Presidents are, don't know, don't fight, uh, except George Washington, the first president of the United States, and some other presidents were war uh, generals as well. But a lot of them were not uh, able the, to fight. In the, when in the past, uh, when you have war, boss at one board, who would be? General. General. Yeah, the general. Or the admiral. Stone. He stone. He. Maybe at that at at this time the generals had to fight, Mm -hmm. but uh, after that, no, they just uh, stay in the in the building in the bunker Bunker. and plan Mm -hmm. uh, the other the other strategies. Anyway, um, a couple other things. So, Columbus, Mm -hmm. Christopher Columbus the guy who, f- who found America. There are many things named after him, his name. So Colombia is a country in South America mm-hmm. that was named after him. Mm-hmm. So the country, Colombia, is named after him. He come and then land his name. No, it's not where he landed. It's just it, he was so important that the country was named after him. Yeah. Also, we have many things in America named after Columbia. We have the space shuttle, one of the one of the rockets oh. that uh, that Go to. now they they don't fly anymore. But one of them was called Columbia, to to because of because of Christopher Columbus. So Columbia is a common name of of ships and. Planes, some, I don't know planes, but anyway, Columbia is a is a common name for for some machines, and because of him, because of like because Co- he found Columbia America. Columbia pictures. Columbia pictures. Maybe that. Yeah, I don't know, but that could be from him as well. Yeah. Uh, oh, I I wrote here that he landed in the Bahamas. 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 So when when Christopher Columbus came to the United States the first time he landed in what what is now the Bahamas. Now the, that place is called the Bahamas. Oh. But at that time it was not. Uh, one other thing. So we also have Thanksgiving in the United States. We have a holiday mm-hmm. called Thanksgiving. Thanksgiving. It's on the third Friday in November. Third Friday. So, not the first Friday, not the second Friday, but the third Friday on uh, in, in. November. November. Maybe, I think it's Thanks. Thursday. No, it's not, it's not Friday. Uh, I don't know why I wrote Friday here. I don't think it, it's Friday. It's Thursday. 
แต่งแต่งกอดเดลวันขอบคุณพระเจ้าเดฟอแต่งกอดหรอ no so Thanksgiving was the, the, there was a party and there were Puritans okay. and religious people remember those were mm-hmm. religious people that came to, to the United States and some Native American people mm-hmm. I don't remember what they were called did I write it down here oh yeah Wham Wampanoag Wampanoag I don't know how to pronounce it but anyway there were Native Americans and Puritans mm-hmm. that supposedly maybe had a party together mm-hmm. and that became Thanksgiving mm-hmm. in 1621 so there are many things that happen uh, on Thanksgiving and uh, it's a it's a holiday people like to eat a lot they eat turkey I don't think turkeys are in the United States in Thailand. Friend and family, l Like s o n g g a n Yeah, you're supposed to spend time with your friends and maybe your enemies, <laughs> and you can be good friends together uh, during that time. And then after Thanksgiving, you can go back to being uh, enemies. Anyway, that's my basic American history. Uh, remember, I don't really know <laughs> very well. Uh, it's not a. It's not supposed to be correct. It's just supposed to be basic, so that you can understand what basically happened. So that you, if someone says, "Oh, you know, why do American people speak English?" Okay, so you understand they mm. came from England, okay. right? So remember, the Columbus came to America. One seven seventeen fourteen ninety two. Fourteen ninety two. So five hundred years ago, oh, Columbus 1492. came to America, and then people said, "Okay, we gotta we gotta go there. We gotta get we gotta get that land. We gotta get the gold." Five year, five hundred yeah. years ago. Yeah. So then people started coming over mm-hmm. uh, and making cities and fighting wars, killing Native American people there, stealing their gold. Taking everything that they had until you have America now. Until you made Mission. America, and then uh, uh, American people said, "Okay, kick the British people out, get rid of get rid of them. We don't want to pay taxes anymore." And all the other countries did that too. They also in South America they said, "We're not giving money to Spain anymore," mm. right? So many many countries in South America they speak Spanish. Mm. Because they, because people came from Spain, except uh, Brazil, which is Portuguese. Brazil. Brazil, Portuguese from Portugal. Portuguese. From Portugal. So then, American people kicked out the British. English people said, "Okay, we don't want to pay you anymore." There was a war. After that, the United States was formed. After that. Uh, the United States fought uh, other wars, <laughs> many, many wars, fighting a war uh, against the United States, against the North and the South. That was the Civil War, fighting because of slavery. And then after that, uh, that was in 1860 or something. And then, so that was 140 years ago. And then, in 1920, then 100 years ago, that's when uh, the Titanic, uh, mm. 1912, I think, came to United States and sunk. So then, many people came on boats to the United States, um, and the United States got bigger and bigger, and. Uh, Don't want other people anymore. Right now, uh, no more poor people allowed. Yes. Okay. Questions about that? So you, so you, you say the basics. So the Christopher Columbus, he came. You tell us the basics of American history. For, um, first, first. Christopher Col- Columbus. 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 Columbus came. 500 years ago. About Five, 500 years ago. 500 years ago, he mm-hmm. found 
America. He thought he found China, <laughs> right? He's like, oops, uh, okay, okay, wrong. When he came to America, right, and went back, mm-hmm. and after that, um, Spain came to everyone. Everyone. They all. They everyone came to America, trying oh. to g- get the gold and the and the land. Everyone. Mm. Except the Germans. I don't know why Germany. Um, I, I'm. I don't know. I don't know why Germany did. But I, 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 I saw. I watched. I watched many, many movie about German and America fighting. Right. That's in World War Two. That's coming later. That's 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 in 1943. So that was uh, 80 years ago. This this is 500 years ago. Mm. Yeah. And after that. Many people from everywhere. Not everywhere, but from Europe. From Europe, came to America. Yeah, and took the gold. Took the gold. And killed the people there. Killed people there. And uh, took the land. Took the land. Yeah. <laughs> That's so horrible. Yeah, it was, right? Until, until, they made cities. cities. They were called colonies. Colony. Mm-hmm. It's like a city. Mm-hmm. Colony mm-hmm. for people from men from yeah there was there were French colonies and Spanish colonies and maybe Portuguese colonies and people British from colonies. many many country yep live together no each one had their own colonies uh, so there were colonies of of English speaking people from mm-hmm. England. And there were colonies of Spanish-speaking pe- people from Spain, and Portuguese, and French, and maybe others, but I don't know. Those are the ma- those were the main ones. I don't understand why Germany didn't go, but um, probably that's why they were sad about that and went there after World War II. But anyway, so yeah, then everyone came, and then Spain and England, they said, okay, you have to send us money. Mm. Okay, and then what happened? They don't want to. Right, America didn't want to pay anymore. Right, they didn't live. In seventeen seventy-five, so just live or fight. Two hundred years ago, then they fought a war in the mm. United States, but different countries in America f- stopped paying uh, taxes at different times. So in America, we we got rid of the British in. Uh, like 200 years ago, but other countries didn't. Mm. So Canada, they they didn't do that. Mm. They didn't fight against the British. And in other, I don't know in South America when the different countries stopped or when they fought for their independence. But the United States was was 200 years ago. After they have war. After they fought. After they fought. 200 years ago. Who win? The United States Win. kicked the British out, mm. and they lost. And at that time, Americans were sneaky. So the British, they used to wear really bright red coats. We call them the red coats, mm. and they all had uniforms, and they were easy to see. Mm-hmm. And Americans, we thought we were really smart. Probably the British said, "You're terrorists," <laughs> but we <laughs> Americans dressed up in green and different colors and hid. So the so it wasn't easy to see mm. American people. The British were easy to see because they had they had uniforms. Mm. So at that time, Americans were terrorists what because time? because <laughs> we were fighting the British. The British said these are these are terrorists. But anyway, so the British got kicked out. Mm. There was uh, lots of trouble, and then uh, they went home, and then America was formed. We form and fight again. Well, then, then we need. Then there needed to be people to work because Americans mm. are lazy. Another problem came. Right. So then, then bring people from Africa mm-hmm. to work for free because Americans are not not strong enough to mm. work. And then, and then there was another battle, right? In what time? In about 150 years ago, there was a there was a civil war. Mm-hmm. And the North won, the North part of the United States, 
in the South uh, with, with the president who dressed up in a dress, the, the lady boy, <laughs> he dressed up in a dress. He tried to run away and then they lost. So then slavery, slavery was ended in the United States, but it was only the slavery that was ended. People were still, people were still mean. People were still, anyway, we'll, we'll talk about that later. But anyway, so there was a lot of problems mm -hmm. with, with slavery in the United States. And then after that, after that, um, Titanic came. Right. And then people kept coming. Uh, America was growing. Um, there was a lot of gold in California. Lots mm -hmm. of people went across the United States to get gold in California. In the beginning, the big cities were New York mm -hmm. and, and on the East Coast because everyone came from England to to stay on on the east side of America. There wasn't very many people on the west side. So then a lot of people uh, started to go to California because th they heard there was a lot of gold there. Mm. And now um, California is the richest Richie. place in the United States uh, because of Silicon Valley <clears throat> and technology companies there. Oh. Yeah, so that was up until about 1900. 1900. So 100 years ago. And then many things happened uh, in that, that 100 years that we'll talk about uh, later. Questions about that? I don't, I don't know very many things, but if you have any questions about um, things that you heard or things that you heard in school or Things that you thought or, or didn't understand. You call people from another another country, but you don't you don't accept it. Nikki, lah. Nikki, what's Nikki? Nick, Nick, Nikki and Nikki. I heard before. Another country. Accept people. Um, people type now, or you mean now? in the past? No. Okay, now. People try, try to come in America. To America. To America, but not right, right. Nobody can come anymore. Nobody. They hide. Well, yeah, people sneak in. Oh, uh, they like sneak, sneak, sneak in. Yeah, people. Sneak yeah, in. people sneak in, but uh, they they can't get jobs. It's mm. not easy to stay. They don't have identification. Like Pama, yeah. Myanmar. Sneak, sneaking. Yeah, exactly. In people, Thailand. people sneak into the United States, but what people do is, in the United States, we have a law, and it it's important because, but it causes a lot of trouble uh, for Im for immigration. But in the United States, we have a different law than in other countries, which says, if you have a baby in the United States, mm -hmm. the baby is American. Doesn't matter who the parents are. Okay, mm -hmm. so if I if I come to Thailand with my wife mm -hmm. from America, and we have a baby in mm -hmm. Thailand, that baby is not Thai. Mm -hmm. But in America, if you and your and you and Duck <laughs> go to America mm -hmm. and you have a baby, mm -hmm. that baby is American, oh. and they can get an American passport. It's very important because when America started people were from different countries mm. and they didn't want there to be trouble where they said, okay, well, you're not American or you are American Again. and you have to pay or you don't. And so everyone who is born in America is an American. It doesn't matter where their parents come from. It's, and so many people, they go on trips to America to have kids, mm. especially rich people. They want their kids to have an American passport. It's called an anchor baby. And if anchor, they anchor baby. Yeah, anchor baby. An anchor is the thing that is from a ship oh. that you throw off the ship to hold the ship in place. And so they they imagine that the baby is is holding them to the United States. Anyway, many rich people do that. They go to the United States and they have a baby there so that the um, so that the baby can have an American passport. And many people in the United States are angry about that. 
but it's not easy to change the law because the law is necessary to prevent the problems of who's American and who's not. Mm. So it's a big problem in the United States. Yeah, it's hard to control or fix because America is very big. And it's not about being big. It's just about who who has uh, American citizenship and who doesn't. In other countries, they don't allow that. You know, if if I go to Japan and I have a baby, that baby is not Japanese. If I go to Myanmar and have a baby, that baby is not. Myanmar, not Burmese, but in the United States, uh, if you go and have a baby, then it's an Amer it's a, it's a, it has an American citizenship. If, Amer if American people have kids with with someone sneaking, mm -hmm. what happened with children? Children is American. That's what the and law can Kim and can um, can live in America. Yes. So that's why there's there. There's many problems. Is to is to stop that, is to stop that kid from not having a home. Mm -hmm. So if someone comes to the United States from Mexico mm -hmm. and has a child, then if we didn't allow them to be an American citizen, then then they might not have a citizenship, because maybe they can't go back to Mexico or they can't go back to Thailand because maybe they came. Uh, maybe they came on a boat or something and they can't mm -hmm. go back. So the law is to make sure that everyone born in the United States is uh, American. Also, our names are, are different because when my great grandfather came to America, mm -hmm. uh, he was from Iceland near uh, near near England. There's another island. It's called Iceland. It's not very far away, but it's cold. Mm -hmm. And he came to the United States, and probably he didn't speak any English. But they said, "What's your name?" And probably he was like, "Oh, buckle, buckle, buckle. <laughs> and they said, "No, no, <laughs> that doesn't sound like a name." So then they asked, "Well, what city are you from?" What city are you from? What city are you from? And then they gave people the names of their cities. Mm. So a lot of people in America have last names that are cities of the places where they came from. Like, for example. Oh, I I don't have any examples, but I'm just saying that it could be anything. But some, but a lot of names are from cities of the places where people where people came mm. from, and the names are are simplified. They're easier because their names. Where they came from were too were too difficult to say or were not were not easy to say in English. And why why you have um, name tree first middle middle? Oh, I I don't know that that's just a tradition. Tradition. Yeah, it's just not everyone. Just most people have a middle name. You? Yeah. Yes. But uh, but it, why did they give? Well, it's it's just it's just what your parents want to give you, so the last name is your father's name. Mm. The middle and first name are are just chosen. You you can pick whatever you want. Mm. So if you have a baby, the last name should be the dad's name, if you know the dad's name, and then. <laughs> uh, you know. Well, if you if you don't, then you, it would have to Ma be the Ma mom's. It Ma would have to be the mom's name. Oh. But the other two names are. Are are just made up. Now, many people now they will get they will choose the first name. They will just pick a name. Mm -hmm. This the middle name will be the mom's last name, and then the last name will be the dad's last name. Many mom's people do that, name. but mine is not. My mom chose both of my names. Mm -hmm. uh, thankfully. Um, my my dad didn't let my mom choose. Uh, my mom wanted to give me a a really dumb name because my mom's a my mom's a hippie, so she wanted to give me a stupid name. And mm. my dad said no. Mm. He said it's gonna. He said John. He said you can't you can't name him that. But when you you 
um, order if you want to change it. You can change your name. Yeah, you can change your name if not, you want. Not hard, easy. To do. Uh, I don't know if it's easy, but um, it, you, you have to pay money and it, you, know, you have to change all of your accounts and all of those things. Anyway, so that's my bad uh, American history class. No, uh, it's good. You can make a very, very wrong story. Yeah, you exactly. Can chart. Well, that's what we need. You don't need to waste time <laughs> learning American history. Just the basic stereotypes and basic things so that when someone says, why do American people, why is it not called American? Why, is it, why do they speak English and not American-ish? Then okay, then you understand, right? Yeah. That's what we're that's what we're doing. Okay, any questions? No. Thank you so much. If you want to see Sibti uh, traveling to America, <laughs> I, my dear, that's my dear. Will she be on the Titanic too? No. Oh no. Okay, no, not the Titanic. <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank you. Bye bye. <laughs>